this is just about half past six in the morning and I've just come down after walking the dogs to find this paddle up. And I've tried to actually lower it because this is quite when I put this on nothing is happening even without taking that off. broken, can't you? Yeah. Next one. seen some boats coming up um, yeah so we were at the back of the queue uh, Mark and Julie have already gone down and then uh, Mark went down with another boat so that left us behind so we think 
probably Mark and Julia's probably about 45 minutes ahead of us now. Well, they're definitely one lock and a, and a lift bridge. Yeah. So they're coming up on. Yeah, they'll be at Aldermaston soon. So this lot we're coming up to now is Woolhampton. Oh yes, legendary Woolhampton. I need to go and find my key. You don't get key. it right, you end up sideways. So we're at the legendary Woolhampton lock. Uh, the last time we did this, this was a bit different to what it looks like today. What makes this so complicated is the lock comes there and then immediately to the right is the river and what can happen is it, as you come out you get pushed over so there's the river and I think you might be able to make out this is what happens here comes through the river as you come through the lock you get pushed through when we came through here last time that was running really fast so we had to be really careful when we came through here to go in the lock and I've got to go and set the road bridge so they can come out See what it was. That's Julie over on the left, over my controls. ABC, isn't it? ABC oh, boat. look at this little dinky worm. Called the, the shoveler. Old to get back out. Yeah, look at that. Uh, it's fed up with the tires in the water. Yeah. Oh, look at that old one there, look. That's pretty. We even got the original there. Uh, nice, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, isn't that the tea room? Yes, it is. That's what the old stable look. Still in existence, only just though, needs a bit of TLC on that. So that's the old, and now this is the new then. Full of water. Full of water, yeah. Poor James. Nice. Very nice. They are pretty, aren't they? Very pretty. Lovely frontage out onto the onto the canal. Another old one there. Look at all the Tudor beams on them. So lovely. And this is Older Marston Wharf.
where we came down to view a boat. If you remember in previous vlogs we mentioned it. The fire boat, skull and crossbones area. <laughs> yeah. There's a little shop in there. We've been in there. And the lifting crane. So when they hire a boat from here then, the first thing they've got to go and do is operate that road bridge. Yep. Oh, that's a baptism of fire then. Oh yeah, hi. I've seen this boat as well before, perhaps a daisy. So just a couple of marquees then, <laughs> on some floating blocks. There you go, that's how you make a dry dock. Oh, oh right, okay. Coming into a lock and um, Mark and Julia. Mark and Julia Start there. Yeah. Mark just helped us through the last lock, which was the scalloped edged one. And, Swing bridge, lock. Yeah, the gate is going to stay there, it's staying until 4 o'clock, won't break it. Great, so it's just while we're going down, it's going to be out of action soon. So, what bridge is that? Tarmel. Tarmel, oh yes, because there was a problem with Tarmel, wasn't it? So, we're working on it this morning. When it closes, it then sits down, mm -hmm. the barriers come up, mm -hmm. and it wasn't sitting down all the way, then it took it back up again. Oh, okay. Okay.
spotted him. was interesting, the bird was chirping in the same time as the engine. Birds copying the engine. How bizarre. Never heard that before. This is the electric boat. Oh, man. 